I'm Sarah Sabin, Transformational Leadership Coach, and in today's video, I want to talk about how empathy feeds into building a strong work culture. So um, what the um, culture looks like within organisations is a hot topic uh, post-pandemic. And what is becoming clear is that empathy forms part of that strong work culture because empathy gives us understanding of what our various stakeholders need. So starting with employees, taking steps to actually establish what our employees think and feel rather than trying to guess what they think and feel helps employers to close any perception gap between what's actually going on, what, what they think is going on. And if you can close that perception gap, you have happier employees. And happier employees tend to serve customers better and are more likely to go the extra mile. But it's also important to have empathy in understanding your customer as well. And the benefits of doing this work for both of those stakeholder groups is finding the intersection between what the employees um, say they need and what the business needs in order to serve customers in the highest possible way. So empathy um, in relation to stakeholders can actually inform um, your planning going forward and the kind of initiatives you bring in at work. Also within Building a strong work culture, having very clearly defined values that are lived by everyone in the organisation um, is really, really important. And having the balanced empathy to uh, stand by those values and to root out bad behaviours and uh, toxic um, elements within the organisation will contribute towards long-term sustainability of the company. So it makes sense to have all employees aligned value-wise. And to give an example of this, Hewlett Packard has done it really, really well. So they've created an undeniably financially successful company um, and a culture based on collectivism and empathy. And again, coming back to that balance empathy. So expectations are really clear. Um, all expect all employees are expected to form perform to a high level. They're all expected to act in integrity and act in the best uh, interests of the customer. And what's important as well is actively rooting out behaviors, values, habits that contravene that and acting accordingly so that all employees can have faith that the actual system works.